What's going on guys? Mike here again. I am stuck with working on the S2000 right now. I have to use this for the first time. These are, what do they call them, easy outs. Unfortunately, running my turbo system, a full race kit on the S2000, the exhaust manifold studs broke off because of the slant of the turbo. Obviously because it heats up, they get brittle, I don't know if they get brittle, but you know, the heat has some type of factor of them breaking off and all the weight that's on, on the turbo on the side. So, as you can see, this plane taking off. Uh, the manifold is a slant style, and the weight of the turbo um, snaps the exhaust manifold studs off. So, three of them broke off on the S2000 motor. There's seven of them that hold it up, so it was only hold on by four. And I went ahead and got some uh, Speed Factory exhaust manifold replacements. These are made out of uh, titanium. Uh, these were beasts, it was a set of 10, but I got those at a Black Friday special. And now I have to use this for the first time. Um, hopefully it works and I don't fail. So. The process is uh, the studs broke clean off. Well, they're actually um, they're actually broke off way in there. I'm gonna have to drill, take one of the drill bits, and hopefully drill through the center. Drill through the center, and then take one of these kind of reverse thread um, extractors, and hopefully it comes out. If not, I'm pretty much um, screwed. <laughs> Pretty much screwed. I mean, it's either that or you know, retap the block, Healy coil it somehow. It's limited space in this thing, so if you guys can see, um, there's a kind of a limited space to work with. Uh, I took the remaining studs off. I didn't have the kit um, to extract it out, so this is me extracting out a broken stud. Hopefully, it works. Well. <sighs> The first step of me doing this is using an angled drill. I purposely brought a, this drill in order to kind of not having to remove a lot of things as far as the AC lines and everything like that. But um, you're, the, the process is, you know, basically you're gonna drill into the center of the stud. Hopefully you have some type of punch to do it to make sure that, you know, the, the motor's angled. So it's gonna be kind of a tough to hit and do it correctly. and hole's been drilled so you take your little easy out and hopefully it goes in What you're gonna do, tap that bad boy in. This is where I'm at currently. You guys can see, I'll get a close up of that one. If you guys can see, I have the stud in here, and here's the, uh, it's not perfectly centered, but it did catch. Um, I hammered it in, I hammered in the, uh, the reverse. Um, uh, easy out and now it's just a matter of uh, turning slowly in order to extract it. Uh, it didn't come as out as easy as you'd expect. I think it's kind of on there so um, this is the process. I wish I had a ratcheting thing above her and plus I'm freaking holding the camera. This is for you guys. Damn you. All right. So with this ratchet, it kind of works. It's like maybe a star pattern or something like that. Yeah, it's a little off-centered. And 
That is focus. Sheesh. And this is uh, me taking out a stud. There we go. Stud is removed. <laughs>